All right, I know it's already been two days since I uploaded my last Resident Evil 4 video, but come on, Resident Evil 4 is too good not to be freaking, not to be making another video about it. But this isn't, this isn't a video about the game itself, because I still gotta finish Grand Theft Auto 5. It's gonna be a video, as you guys see from the title, the thing that scared me most in Resident Evil 4, in my opinion. So, so you might be thinking that the thing that scares me the most is most likely the regenerators, or the refrigerators. Sorry. But, lo and behold, it's not. The whole reason I'm, the reason it's not scared, the whole reason I'm s scared of the refrigerators is because... When you run to them, and oh my gosh, they had just have that face, and they give you a freaking violent hug. They grab a, they give you a violent hug, but then you grab you by the neck with their teeth, and they start chewing you. That thing scares me the most. But lo and behold, it's not. The thing that really scares me the most in Resident Evil 4 is this. This. Oh yeah, and I also got the typewriter. Get mostly everything. Cause I'm cool. But yeah, this is the thing that scares me the most in Resident Evil 4. And just keep you just keep in mind that I didn't do this before because I wanted to keep my death count low. But this thing makes me jump even when I know that it's gonna happen. Oh, did you see that? That even made me jump, even though I was still talking about it. Oh my gosh. But then, this kind of got me wondering. So, it triggers when you shoot at it. But what happens if you shoot at it with a rocket launcher? Let's say the same. Because it's not a gun. It's a more powerful gun. So I proceeded to do it. I kept proceeding to do it. And I did it a fourth time to see what it would do. No Delago. So I proceeded to do it a fifth time. He still didn't show up because it's a rocket launcher. And he's so scared of it. Then this thing, powerfuler than a rocket launcher, shot it. That made me jump. Still. See? I have no idea what's with the logo. Why? Why he does that? So... That that's the thing that scares me the most in Resident Evil 4. It's not the re it's not the refrigerators. It's that thing. They built in a jump scare to scare you. Even though the water doesn't even look that deep. They built in a jump scare. So yeah. I know when it's gonna happen. But I still it still gave me the shivers. Oh yeah, that's a glitch. If you, if you have the striker, you just aim, aim it like, like aim it and then hurry up and go back into your inventory, switch out to another gun, and you have max five speed. But yeah, I drop, and then what I thought, I couldn't do anything else besides so just shoot at the water and have him eat me. So. I proceeded to try another thing. We got on the raft. Get throwing.
had thrown the harpoons in the water. Nothing happened. So I proceeded to watch the cutscene. I started violently hitting him, and then I fall out. So I proceed to do the boss fight again. Ain't really n nothing too special. This bad. This Delago is the scariest monster in the Resident Evil 4. The reason for that is the jump scare and the one and the deaths that he gives you. Deaths. Delago is more scarier than the Regenerates. All because of he's in the water and Yeah, Delago is easily the scariest monster in Resident Evil 4, in my opinion, because of the way, because of the deaths and the jump scare. And also, as of recording this, when that death happens, it just shows you like the the side of him, like it doesn't show you the mouth part portion. It just goes in the stomach, like you just see the stomach, and then. Um, it's just, a, uh, again, you just hear Leon screaming, and you see his stomach. But that was not a plan. I did not expect him to show the mouth, but, yeah. In my opinion, Delago is easily the scariest monster in Resident Evil 4. Judging by that jump scare, and the way Leon dies. Because it's all based around water. And with generators, you can see very closely with your eyes. Delago is a huge fish that can easily eat you with one gulp. And that's what he, exactly what he did to me. A bunch of times. But yeah. That was another video of Resident Evil 4. And I believe when I come back to when I come back to Resident Evil 4 it's gonna be like I'm, 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 I'm gonna be doing these extra missions. Or these extra things. But yeah, hope you guys all enjoyed, and tell me and down in the comments, what monster do you think is the scariest monster in Resident Evil 4? Is it Delago? Is it Elegantis? Or Ella Thick Boy? Or is it the Refrigerators? Or the Iron Maiden? Or maybe it's one of the, the characters, like the Insta-Kill Parasites, the, oh my gosh. I'll do a video on the sc most scariest parasite. I'm kidding. I know the most scariest parasite. The scariest parasite is the insta-kill one because they can insta-kill you. But the most disgusting one has to be that little spider one. It is absolutely disgusting. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. And yeah. Peace. Demons out. Bad death was unexpected. Holy crap.